What about me? Meg Bitlip says Oprah with Gail King denied to take Duchess to Louis Vuitton cruise show. Recently, Oprah Winfrey showcased her slimmed down physique after undergoing a weight loss reset last year. The TV personality, 69, looked sensational in a belted cord that highlighted her svelte waist as she attended the Louis Vuitton cruise show at Isola Bella in Italy on Wednesday with Gail King. However, one of Oprah's self-described fashionistas, Meghan Markle, who listed Louis Vuitton as one of her favorite brands, was not present. Apparently because to allegations made against Sussex in the NYC car chase, Meghan Markle recently chose not to attend the Gracie Awards. In addition, the American people condemned the yellow dress the Duchess wore to the awards event a week ago as being tacky and unattractive. As a result, Meghan Markle has to take action to justify her status as a fashion icon in order to restore her reputation. And source said that Meghan Markle proposed the Duchess attend the Louis Vuitton cruise show to celebrate her return. Oprah and Gail King flatly denied her request. In order for the Duchess to stand out at the occasion, Meghan also requested that Nicolas Gasquier, the creative director of Louis Vuitton, create a new custom Louis Vuitton gun for her. Previously, Meghan Markle used to put a new spin on evening elegance with her latest red carpet appearance in custom Louis Vuitton, designed by the house's creative director Nicholas Gesquier when she and Prince Harry attended the 2022 Robert F. Kennedy Human Rights Ripple of Hope Award Gala in New York City, where the couple received an award for their charitable work through the Archule Foundation. But Nicholas rejected, citing his hectic schedule in preparation for the event as justification for his refusal. On the other side, both Oprah and Gail King threw the Duchess under the bus, which greatly incensed and enraged the Duchess. Meanwhile, Oprah has appeared in an embellished black belt cinched in an oversized white striped shirt that she paired with a pair of flowing trousers. She added to the look with a small Louis Vuitton handbag and donned dazzling diamond earrings. The talk show host finished off the look by styling her raven locks in a sleek half-up style to frame her pretty features. Oprah's outing comes after she vowed to reset her weight loss last year. The self-confessed Yo-Yo Dita is an ambassador for WW, formerly Weight Watchers, and last year revealed she was on track for a healthier lifestyle as she kicked off 2020 by bidding farewell to the special bananas foster birthday cake she had made for her best friend Gail King. The media mogul took to Instagram to share a video of herself tossing the leftovers in the trash while opening up about her plans to get back on track with her eating after the holidays. Time for a reset. I'm clearing out my fridge, she explained. You know we had 12 people over the house over the holidays. All stayed safe from Covid, thank God. And I gotta say, we ate every day like food had just been invented. The WW spokesperson, who previously lost £40 following the points-based plan, went on to promote the subscription-based program to her 20.4 million followers. Her marketing contract with WW is up in 2023, but she has agreed to serve as an advisor for the company through May 2025. The television producer helped revive the company back in 2015 when she bought 10% of its shares, though her stake is now down to just 2%, the New York Post reported. Oprah opened up about her experience with Weight Watchers and her weight loss in the January 2016 issue of O, the Oprah magazine, which was dedicated to self-improvement. I was fed up with my lose and gain again routine, she wrote. I had enough of no-carb regimens. Some people can live without bread and pasta, but it just doesn't make sense to me. On the system, foods and meals are broken down into points based on its protein, carbohydrates, fat, and fiber. Oprah revealed at the time that she was allotted 30 points a day, a number that was determined by her height, age, gender, and current weight. While she lost 5 pounds during her first week on the program, she admitted that she had been resisting Weight Watchers since the 1970s because she never had the time to go to their meetings and she hated the idea of counting anything. The media mogul, whose heaviest weight was 237 pounds, noted that she has lost the same amount of weight many times throughout the years.
but these five pounds were different because she was ready and she no longer had to obsess about what she could or couldn't eat. You were number one in your eyes Thought I'd try a stormer in it If it went riding out of destiny in the day With the real eye as more we can appear For the freedom she found so What about me? Meg Bitlip says Oprah with Gail King denied to take Duchess to Louis Vuitton cruise show. Recently, Oprah Winfrey showcased her slimmed down physique after undergoing a weight loss reset last year. The TV personality, 69, looked sensational in a belted cord that highlighted her svelte waist as she attended the Louis Vuitton cruise show at Isola Bella in Italy on Wednesday with Gail King. However, one of Oprah's self-described fashionistas